We're approaching Northridge. All right. It's a good time to bring everyone up to speed. This is a rescue mission, as simple as it gets. We go in, secure the perimeter, and prepare the evacuation. I don't want anyone to draw Skynet's attention. We're not prepared for that. We keep our heads down and evacuate those people to safety. What if there's no one to evacuate? Care to elaborate, Corporal? Outposts don't stay silent for that long. If no one's been reporting in, I'd expect to find the remains of a massacre, sir. I think introductions are in order. The eternal optimist sitting next to me is Corporal Farrow, an explosive specialist. Sergeant Rivers and I have already been introduced. What about you, Evans? What's your story? I've read your file. You're the sole survivor from the 113th, right? 113th? I've heard about it. How'd you manage to escape? Supposedly he took down a T-800 with his bare hands. That's impossible. That's what I'm saying. Is it true? Did John Connor select us for this assignment? That's right. I'd like to meet him. Complete the mission and you just might. We're getting close. Get ready. Northridge is up ahead. Evans, give us the sit rep. No signs of any resistance soldiers at the gate. <sighs> Not good. 3T600 approaching 1 o'clock. T600? They're still around? Let's not get sloppy. We don't know what's behind that gate. This is a tech comm mission. I want us to move fast. I want us to be efficient. Understood? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Now let's clear the area. Evans, you want to start us off? Affirmative. Everyone on me! Target acquired. Get ready. 
Two in front! Down they go! Stay frosty. We don't want to shoot friendlies. If there are any friendlies left alive, the doors to the garage are wide open. What the fuck is going on, Sergeant? Where is everyone? Clear the area, Sergeant. We'll figure it out later. Fuck shit, man. Enemies coming from the left. Last one. Evans, how's it looking on your side? That's all of them. Then secure the perimeter. What do we do now? We need to report this. Find a radio station and keep your eyes open. Yes, sir. No bodies? This doesn't make any sense. I understand you're not happy with the situation, but for now you'll have to stay put. At least until I discuss your next move with Connor. Is that clear? Yes, Commander. Awaiting further instructions. Over and out. Alright. Looks like we're turning in for the night. I understand that not everything went as planned today. There are still a lot of unanswered questions here. But for now, get some rest. Tomorrow will be when the real work starts. We've received permission from HQ to follow the signal. Next stop is Bakersfield. That's two hours away from the nearest resistance outpost. So if it gets too heated, there's no chance of support? That's right. Anyone have a problem with that? No, sir. I've got one thing, Sarge. Farrell? Shotgun. Shotgun? I only brought my rifle. Oh. Um, okay, forget it. This is it. The message was sent from somewhere around here. It wasn't accurate enough to give us the exact location. So to cover more ground, we'll be splitting into two groups. I'll be spotting for Rivers. Evans, you spot for Pharaoh. What exactly are we looking for, sir? Any signs of civilian activity. No one's been in the area for a long time, so report anything you see. Understood? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Rules of engagement, sir. Fire at will. Let's move out. Rivers, let's go. Where do we start? There used to be a non-military checkpoint at an old command center in this area. That's where I want you to go first.
Terminator's 12 o'clock. What do we do? We could let him pass. It's your call. Nice and easy. The building over there is a good vantage point. I'll be able to navigate you from there. Are you sure you're ready to do this on your own? Yes, sir. All right, then. Just keep your radio close. Good luck, Rivers. HK Aerial flying by. We don't have enough firepower to destroy it, so keep an eye on it. If it searchlight spots you, you're out of luck. I'm at the top. I got a good view from here. I can see that the HK could be a problem. Rivers, I've noticed something. There's a Skynet antenna not far from your position. I think that HK is part of its surveillance. That's why it keeps popping up. Anything we can do about it? It's too dangerous. These types of facilities usually have their generators deep underground. First, you need a way to get down there. So you're saying I need a rope? I don't think you're hearing me, Rivers. But technically speaking, yeah, you need a rope. Found a rope. So you're really gonna go through with this? Word of warning. Get yourself some sound decoys. The perimeter around the antenna is littered with silverfish. I see a junkyard close by. If you need some scrap metal to craft sound decoys, that's where you'll find it. I'm getting closer to that checkpoint. It's out of my building's compromised. Clear. I'd like to proceed forward, sir. We need to be sure. Just be careful, Rivers. No one here. Take a look around. See if you can find something useful. Uh, I found a note about their evacuation plan. It points to a location nearby. It's worth checking out.
This is the place mentioned in the note. Proceed with caution. Sergeant, I hear a child's voice coming from inside the building. Child, here? Keep your eyes open. Where are you? I'm over here. Can you hear me? One piece. It was stupid. I should have known something was up. That's how the machines operate. They use our humanity against us. Don't beat yourself up, soldier. Just means you're still human. What was that? I fell into a basement. Shit! That's what here. Stay calm. Try taking them one by one. Let's 
all in. Proceeding with the mission. I'm in the command center. Good. Take a look around and see if you can find anyone. Nothing so far. Ariel! Two of them. We need to clip their fucking wings. Where are they heading? I can see them touching down at what looks like a refueling station. You can try sabotaging if you're up for it. I'm sure Pharaoh and Evans would appreciate that. Just another encoded message. Evans, how's it looking on your end? We just noticed some movement. Someone or something was heading your way. We lost sight of it close to the cemetery. Cemetery? I see it. Rivers, I'm marking it on your map. It's close. Heading there now. Watch out! Hostiles approaching the building.
The antenna. I see it. Hacking it will grant us control over those surveillance turrets. They're equipped with a second generation plasma rifle. Strong enough to bring down an HK? Exactly right. How do I get inside? There has to be a way down. Keep your eyes open. I see it. I won't be able to hear from you when you get down there. So good luck.
This is it. Reporting back. The generator's offline. Move back, Rivers. The antenna's gonna blow. Holy shit! That flash of light was you? Are we trying to destroy Skynet? I thought this was just a rescue mission. Apparently not for Rivers. Evans, we've got to step it up. I appreciate keeping the morale up, Rivers. I'm at the cemetery. The gate is breached. Approach with caution. Sergeant, there's no one here. Evans must have seen a Terminator. All right, Rivers. Time to pack up and go. Check if there's anything that we could use. <coughs> Wait! <coughs> I hear something. It's coming from a coffin. Be careful. Don't shoot. Don't shoot! Sergeant, I found <sighs> some. <sighs> Are you the one that sent us that message? Yes. Yes, I am. I've been trying to reach you ever since I escaped from the convoy. Rivers, we'll question him later. We need to get him out of there. Yes, sir. Move out. I'm heading your way. All right. Let's move. Coming. Stay low.
It's safe now. Rivers, over here. Follow me. We need to get that man to safety. I've set up an evacuation point this way. Terminators, you stay behind. Rivers, on me. Please, God, don't let them die. I don't want to be left alone anymore. Evacuation route leads through that building. Then let's clear the way. Let's go! Evans, Pharaoh, we got the package. You're clear to evac. Copy that. We'll be heading out soon. I'll just set a couple more explosives as a parting gift for Skynet, and we'll be on our way. Okay, Rivers. I'll take that man out to safety. If you need some time to look around, then this is it. It's up to you. Alright, let's move out. They look just like you guys. Same uniforms, same weapons. We thought we were saved, but they led us to transporters that took us straight to a Terminator factory, with production lines churning out hundreds of them a day. So our missing people are still there? Some. Most of them are in a work camp set up not that far from the factory. Where's that? Further north. How far? I couldn't see. It was dark. It was hard to tell. You know what I'm asking. Was it behind the Annihilation Line? Yes. Yes, it was. Shit. I haven't seen anything like it before. They torch everything in their path. I snuck past it after I broke out of the convoy. The ground was so hot, it melted the soles on my shoes. Did I hear that right? We're crossing the Annihilation Line? That wasn't part of the plan. It was supposed to be a quick recon mission. I haven't decided on anything yet. We're severely unprepared. Are you sure that's where they are? I... What's I, up with him? I don't... I'm not sure. Sir, we have to consider falling back. I've noted your concerns, Corporal. But ultimately, I'll be the one making that decision. Now I need some time to think this through. For now, Pharaoh, set up the perimeter. Evans. You're first on guard duty. Let's clear our heads. Is everything okay? Yes, yes, I'm fine. I'm just tired. I must be seeing things. Yeah, that's right. I'm, I'm just seeing things. You don't sound too happy about what's going on. Why would I be? You've heard Reese. You know what it means. We're crossing the Annihilation Line soon. And what for? To finish a mission that makes absolutely no sense? We're in over our heads. The team should always come first, not the mission. That's what the Resistance taught me. And I know I'm not the only one that feels that way. You do too. That HK in Bakersfield was giving us a lot of problems, and you took care of it because that's what a team does. We look out for one another. Meeting Connor is not worth all of this. Piece of shit! I think there's someone else you should talk to first. God fucking damn it! Is, uh, everything all right? <sighs> this whole situation has me so wound up, I'm shaking. Not good for handling explosives. You're just tired. 
You need a break. I'd love to. But since there's no one in a hundred miles of here that can help, I think I'll have to power through. It's too early to start worrying. Reese hasn't decided anything about crossing the Annihilation Line yet. You know what else he's keeping quiet about? How our previous assignment was stupid and bound to fail. Or how truly fucked up it is that we're back in the trenches just hours after our team got decimated. He hasn't mentioned Brooks, Johnson, or Yang. He hasn't mentioned them once, like they never fucking existed. Pharaoh. I'm sorry. I shouldn't be snapping at you like that. Let's talk. Yeah, let's. Those were the soldiers that died during that mission, weren't they? Yeah, they were. Except they weren't soldiers, not to me. They were my family. They practically raised me. How so? I enlisted when I was 11. I was assigned to this team of four guys who I was absolutely intimidated by. I was trying to play the tough kid in front of them, you know? Constantly trying to impress them. Looking back, I must have been an endless source of entertainment for them. Was Reese one of those people? He was. Well, I hope deep down he still is. The Reese that you've met is not the Reese I knew. That one always had time for his teammates. The man leading us now thinks only about the plan. But, yeah, he used to be part of the team. With the four of them, I was happy. First time in my life I had someone looking after me. That's what I imagine having a family must be like. Now I'm starting to think that if I get killed, Reese won't even care. He can't look me in the eyes. Hasn't said my name this whole time. It's always corporal, like he doesn't know me. What is your name? It's Charlotte. Anyway, thanks for letting me vent. Sometimes that's all it takes. Rivers, can I have a word with you? Sir. I wanted to ask your opinion about what we've heard today. What do you really think happened in Northridge? Do you think that some rogue resistance squad cut a deal with Skynet? Decided to deliver an outpost full of civilians in exchange for some special treatment? Or maybe you have a theory of your own regarding what's happened. To me, this looks like the job of Terminators. This is what the infiltration units were made for. We're just now seeing what they're capable of. I was afraid you'd say that. I trust your judgment. You had the most experience with them. Is that all, sir? One last thing. We all know what the deal is with the T-600s. They're easy to spot and their rubbery mugs are not fooling anyone. But what about this new model? I'm asking you because you're one of the few people that got a look at them up close and lived. See, do you think you would know if you were talking to a Terminator? To be honest, I'm not sure, Sarge. I'm not an expert. I've only encountered one that I know of. That's what I'm afraid of. Thank you for being straight with me. That's it for now. Sarge, actually, I've been meaning to tell you something. I think you should talk to Corporal Farrow. It seems to me that she hasn't fully recovered from your previous assignment. I understand. Unfortunately, that'll have to wait. There's still a lot of work ahead before we move out. I don't mean to step out of line, sir, but that may be part of the problem. I see your point, but I can't risk the safety of my team. Preparations have to come first. You can take a break now, soldier. You did a hell of a job today. What's going on? Ah! What the fuck was that? I don't know, but we're not staying here to find out. Let's go! They're already here. Find some cover! Why the hell did my explosives go off? 
How about we worry about that later? Get that door open! That thing was an HK Centurion. How the hell do you know that? I saw them work on it when I was at that camp. So, another of their weapons has come online. We're in deep shit. There's more! Spread out! Armored Spider, 12 o'clock! Whoa! Scratch that! Everyone focus! Next time that could be one of us. I've got this! That's a firing squad. They were waiting for us. Fuck! Run! I can see the exit! We gotta clear the way! Too many of them! Even more now! Drones! I'm taking them out! Daryl, focus on those fighters, understand? Yes, sir!
Pipe bombs left. Now's the time to use it. Sergeant, I wanted to make an official request for a demotion. There's no need for that, Farrell. The anti-tank mines that I set up didn't work. I feel responsible. It's not your fault. None of this should have happened because we shouldn't even be here in the first place. Easy, soldier. Sergeant, we're about to cross the Annihilation Line, and I'd like to know why. Because you were selected for this mission. That should be enough for you. All due respect, sir, it isn't. Is there something that we don't know yet? What's so special about those people? We've been kept in the dark for too long. Is this how you all feel? Kyle, there has to be more. The last message sent before Northridge went silent. Said that they rescued a group of civilians. These people were kept in cages for years. They were starved, looked like they were barely alive. And despite that, Skynet went looking for them? Why? They mentioned a name. A name Connor wanted to keep a secret. We didn't want anyone to be emotionally invested in the mission. But seeing how we're all looking over the edge now, one of the people rescued was the father of Sergeant Rivers. What? That can't be true, he's dead. He died years ago. Connor got a hold of some intel, confirming that's not true. He's alive, and he's in that camp. Does anyone have any more questions regarding the mission? No. No, sir. All right. We move out in a couple hours. Get some rest. That goes for you too, Rivers. We should be able to see it from that hill. I smell something burning. You're just imagining things. Or not. Holy shit. It stretches as far as the eye can see. And it'll continue to move forward. That's why we need to focus on our objective. We have to create as much havoc as we can. I think they've got that covered. We need Skynet to take the bait. Once they do, they will withdraw some of their forces from that factory, and that's when we'll strike. Everyone knows where their sector is? Yeah. Yeah. Yes, sir. Then let's move out. Everyone in position? I want each of us to find a target. Something that will get Skynet's attention, and then destroy it. Yes, sir. Let's get to work. Rivers, one more thing. There used to be a resistance shelter in your sector. It was probably raided when our soldiers withdrew, but it might be worth investigating. What the fuck is that? Sir, I found a target, but I don't think I've got enough explosives to make a dent in it. Take a picture. I want to see it. Shh. 
Send in the picture now. I see what you mean now. You have to find out what they're using it for. The computer in the nearby outpost should give us some answers. And what about the excavator? Find a way to destroy it. You mentioned an old resistance shelter. I'll see if there are any explosives left that I could use. That looks like your best option. Over and out. wide open. Sergeant, I got enough explosives to bring that excavator down, but there's still a lot of intel lying around here. If Skynet gets a hold of it, we might have a problem. River, you're breaking up. They set a trap. It didn't go off. I should set off the trap. It's too risky to have these documents just lying around here. The detonator jammed. Oh shit! Explosives. Did you run into any problems? No, sir. Uh, proceeding with the main objective.
explosives.
Anything yet, Rivers? Nothing so far, sir. It could be a bogus lead. Keep your eyes open. Heading to the control. Approaching the computer. Sir, I've neutralized my two main targets. All right, Rivers. Unless you need some time to finish any secondary objectives, you can proceed to the extraction point. We'll meet you at that factory. All this will be over soon. The intel I found mentioned that the construction of a nearby rail terminal is almost done. You want to do something about it? Yes, sir. Proceed as you see fit. This is it. That's the factory where they keep the prisoners. Looks like Skynet took the bait. They shifted their security forces. What'd I tell you? Skynet's just a predictable piece of computer software. We can use that against them. The plan is simple. We infiltrate the target building and secure the prisoners. Once we find the people we're looking for, we leave. Rivers, I want us to pick apart what's left of their surveillance. Mark the remaining terminates for Evans to take out. Roger that. I'm in position. Move this way. What the fuck is that? Blood. I'm gonna be sick. Wait. Does that mean? No. This factory's been in operation for a long time. This, this must be old. Rivers. We need to get through that gate. On it. Step back. 
going in. Keep sharp. Danger ahead. T-47, up there! Follow me. Down here. Cover. Signs. We're close. Fuck me, is that? The grinder. Yeah. I never wanted to see it up close. Keep your eyes open. are empty. There must be more. We have to keep going. Reese! Let's go! Contact!
Rivers here! There's more! Up there! Rivers, take it down! Cover! They're still offline. This is... Me. I fucking knew it! Pharaoh. To all that talk about Connor? He was on a fucking mission to terminate him! He got me out of that camp. I wanted to thank him. Bullshit. Wait. Did you sabotage my mines? The ones I set up at the hideout? You won't get away with this. This stops now. It's all in here. Evans was not imprisoned in the camp. He was in a research facility. He used his likeness to create a new type of infiltration unit. But... But how do I know that? From John Connor. I didn't want to believe it. But so far, everything Connor has said has come true. That's impossible. Shit. It says in here that the implementation of Cyberdyne Systems Model 102 is finished. What does that mean? That they no longer have any use for those people. We gotta move. They moved all the prisoners to that second location. We won't find any of them here. Then why are we moving forward? Because we need to burn this fucker to the ground. T-800 production line is live! How about we focus on the one shooting at us? Twelve o'clock! There's more of them on the other side! To now. First, let's take out those drones. We need to deactivate those laser barriers. That's where the main generator is.
There has to be a computer that operates the laser grid. Oh, I see it. Over there. Rivers, get yourself up there. We'll secure the perimeter. It's too quiet. This is making me nervous. Behind you! Still looking. Radio in as soon as you found that computer. Yes, sir. I'm almost there. I can see the computer. Barriers are down. Nicely done, Rivers. Now get down here. We need to go. Dark years are still to come. Does he always speak in code? <sighs> I guess he does. I don't understand half of the things he tells me. Even worse, he makes me memorize things that make no sense to me. Messages to people I've never even met. It feels like he's putting me through tests, you know? Preparing me to be part of something. Some grand scheme. So, why do you trust him? There used to be a simple answer to that question. Connor saved me, taught me how to fight. For a moment, I was even naive enough to think that he prepared me for everything that's out there. He gave me hope. And that used to be enough. And now? Now? Things are different. I've lost most of my previous squad, and I've put the new one in danger by crossing the Annihilation Line. What the hell is all this for? I envy you, Rivers. You've at least got something to fight for. I'll do everything to get my father out of there. But I'll fight for the lives of the other prisoners with the same commitment. How did I know you'd say something like that, Rivers? That's not all, Sarge. That Terminator factory that we just destroyed, it, it couldn't be a coincidence. What do you mean? I think Connor knew what we would find there. He knew about Evans' role in this whole operation. He certainly knew about mine. He sent us here for a reason. 
That does sound like something Connor would do. I believe there's a place in this whole puzzle for every one of us. Funny. For someone who believes there's no such thing as fate, Connor likes to watch things happen exactly as he intended to. Unfortunately, those things sometimes come at a cost. But I don't think Connor would put you through more than he thinks you can handle. Damn it, Rivers. It shouldn't be your responsibility to talk your commander off the ledge. We all need a break sometimes, Sarge. You may be right. Thank you. I needed a fresh perspective. Now, if you don't mind, I got something to do before we leave. Prepare gear and ammo? No. I need that word with Pharaoh. It's been long overdue. Reese? We're ill-equipped. We're too few, and there's no rescue team to come for us. We're behind the damn annihilation line, and I can't protect you from what's out there. That alone is enough to free you of your duty. If you want to leave, just say the word. But if you decide to stay, I can promise that I will fight beside you through whatever happens. So just take your time. Kyle. We're staying. No matter what. Based on the intel we got at the factory, we're looking for Sector A of the camp. That's where your father is, Rivers. Something's happening. Are we late for the party? What the hell are they shooting at? We're about to find out. Hold your fire! Those are friendlies. Look, it's the Resistance! Thank God. What's happening here? There's been a mutiny at the camp. We got together and did whatever we could to break out. And now Skynet's hunting us down. Which sector were you in? Sector B. That's where the mutiny happened. That's where we all came from. What about Sector A? Did those people escape too? No. Sector A is located somewhere else, at a football stadium. Football stadium. All right, we'll find it. Time to move. Hold on, there's more. The reason we broke out is because we heard that Skynet started executing everyone. And Sector A was the first one to go. What? I'm not sure if there's anyone left to save. We'll have to find that out for ourselves. Let's move. There's an extraction point prepared for you. Just follow the path. We'll do that. Hang in there, Rivers. We don't know anything for certain. Yes, sir. Watch out! It's okay! It's fine! There's an evac point ahead! Focus your fire! Contact! Get them to safety. You need to keep going. Are you sure? Don't worry about me. Just go. You heard Evans. Let's move! Good luck, Rivers. I hope you find him. Rivers, we gotta go! HK! Find it! Watch out! There they are! TC! 
600! Flank it! Oh, shit! Too many of them! We gotta bring those numbers down! Rivers, take out those T-800s! Keep firing! How's it looking on your end? The package is secured, but that tank isn't going anywhere. Understood. Report back later. We need to get a visual of the target building. More friendlies! They're wounded. Bad. Reese, we can't leave them behind. Shit! Please, you can't leave us here. Rivers, we have to figure this out. So this is what we're gonna do. Me and Pharaoh are staying here to make sure that these people are escorted to safety. I need you to do a recon of the area, and report when you find the stadium. Running around like that is getting us nowhere. Understood? Yes, sir. Evans, turn that car around. We got more wounded here. I'll be there as soon as I lose that tank. My wife and children... They're still in the camp. I don't know what to do. Don't worry. We'll get them out. That's why we're here. You'll see your family soon. I'm all right, Rivers. We're gonna be all right. Sergeant, I'm three minutes out from your position. Copy that. We're preparing friendlies for evac. I need to find a good lookout spot. I'm under heavy fire! Let's get him on here, too! Sir, HK tank is heading straight for your position! I see it! to get to the evac point. Thank you! Thank you!
Evans, new plan. We have to change location. We need to lose that tank. Copy. I'll intercept you from the other side. Everyone, let's get moving! Uh, there it is. Reese, I've got the visual of the stadium. Roger that. Reunite with the group. We need to concentrate our efforts. Copy. I know. So is Evans. What do we do now? We can't go back, Rivers. Maybe it's not too late. Maybe there's still a chance. We have to at least try. Sir, I know exactly where they are. I laid the way. Near Rivers. Thank you. Let's move! The stadium is that way. Watch it, Silverfish! Too many! Let's take them out, Rivers! We're finishing this mission. For Farrell and for Evans. Yes, sir. Watch out. T-800 patrol in front. We have to wait it out. Stay low.
clear. Let's go. Keep your eyes open. HK flying by. I hear it. Nice and easy. This is it. T-47, I've got a visual. There's enough room to sneak past them. Careful. Clear. Follow me. All right. Now, how do we get inside? There's a terminal. I'll get the gate open. Got it! The gate's open! Let's move! Contact! Open fire! Down here! We'll find him, Rivers. But first we need to open those gates. That's the resistance. No. It can't be. You've got to help us. You're going to be all right. We'll get you out of here. That's the main computer. On it. Only disable all the laser grids. Do it! Barriers are down. Now let's find you. Let's find your father, Rivers. What was that? Centurion! Get into cover! We're boxed in! We need to destroy that fucking thing! Come on! 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 Come on!
not over yet. Let's find your father, Rivers. Frank, have you seen Frank Rivers? Is, is he a human? Dad! You're gonna be all right. We'll get you out of here. I'm looking for Frank Rivers. Is he here? I can't see him. He's gotta be here. I don't see him, Reese. Keep looking. Reese? Kyle, Reese? That's me. I'm Sergeant Kyle Reese. I've got a message for you. I kept it. Dad? I kept it. I kept my promise. I found him. My son, he'd be proud. I am. Today wasn't the final battle of this war. Instead, it was the battle that showed us the parts we needed to play. It reminded us that even if the world my father grew up in is long gone, we still have plenty to fight for in this one. We just need to find a purpose. Something that will keep us going. Even if it's as simple as keeping a promise made to a child. Pharaoh knew that. Evans did too. Today wasn't the final battle of this war. Rivers? But whenever that fight does come, I think now we're ready to meet it. Everything all right? Just, uh, trying to collect my thoughts, Sarge. Understandable. Once we're back in the shelter, I'll put a word in with Baron to ease up on you over the next couple of days. You need a break. We both do. Thank you. There's, um, uh, something I wanted to ask you. Shoot. What was in that envelope? Let me show you. It's a message from John. This is what he wanted me to have. Why? I don't know. Maybe because sometimes I need to remind myself fighting for. 